And now it's just like going off a cliff. There's like no support. So I, I've been, you know, just campaigning. Last Thursday, I think, I started putting on positions in QuantumScape right in front of you guys. It opened a little higher in the uh, pre-market session. I got some at 29.50. I got some at 29.75. Then I put a sell stop at 28.97. The high of that day was 29.83. So I sold at eight cents within the high. And right now it's $3 lower. So I've just been holding these positions at QuantumScape. I've got a uh, in this account, I'm short 37,845. I'm up 102 grand right now based on where the market's trading. Um, I also you know, bought some more puts last night. So last night uh, or yesterday's session, QuantumScape rallied about a dollar. And to me, any, any rally in this, in this you know, uh, stock right now is just meant to be slapped down. So I'm just slightly ahead. Uh, I got some shares of Uber that really disappointed, uh, you know, bought it yesterday and, you know, just kind of sold off. I'll see how it does today. I may or may not blow out. And I was holding, you know, really good profit in these, in these, in these calls earlier yesterday. And now you can see it's turned to a loss. So, but all told, I'm making about 105 grand, uh, you know, based on just, and, and that's the thing, you know, it's, it's all based on this quantum scape that I've held now for, you know, since last Thursday. And, you know, I hope I can, you know, hold it till, you know, the stock goes to $10. So, yeah, I'm making, uh, you know, 67 grand. So this is again, you know, where you try and find something that wins and hold it. And then hopefully it overcomes all your, you know, stupid trades here. So I'm long Uber calls in this one, losing four grand there. I'm losing 50 grand in this Okta stock and I may just blow it out today. I'll see what it does. So I'm making overall about 23 grand in this account. So 105 plus 23 is about $130,000 in these collection of trades. You can see I'm also long 500, 500 puts in this one and 650 puts in the other one. So, you know, that, that's a bet on uh, what, 110,000 shares. And then I've got, you know, some shares in this TAT, you know, just a little bit of a gamble here. Um, so that's really kind of what I got going into today. Oh, QuantumScape's now in the 25s. Broke 25. So uh, getting closer to getting paid on those puts. Uh, and Moderna, I picked up. So Moderna's trading lower. I picked up those uh, 2,000 shares. And... Uh, it's trading three dollars lower. I, I don't know. I would kind of buy into this sell-off and use the two twenty-five as uh, you know as a risk. So if you can risk five dollars and figure out what that risk is, you know I would buy that. So we hit twenty-five ninety, and so you know it's six, it's uh, five days you know in a row lower. So I mean it's it's hard not to take profits here. Um, especially when the profits are now, I've got about 115,000 profit in uh, the stock. Wow. See, QuantumScape, man, I'm telling you, under 25, I think 60 is, the, is the, the lows. And then there's like nothing there to like 23 and a half. And then there's nothing there till, you know, uh, $10. What's your account look like now? Uh, this What's is my profits? Let's see if I blow it up that big. True. Did you just make thirty thousand dollars in six minutes? Yeah. Well, you know. Yeah. So these, you know, this this went from a six dollar gain to thirteen thousand. So I got six hundred and fifty of these bad boys, um, and I've got a five hundred in another account. So that's eleven hundred and fifty. So that's like one hundred fifteen thousand shares, the equivalent. So it'll go dollar for dollar under 25. This quantum scape is getting to real interesting areas here. Um, so you can see this is an area right around here, which is 
about 2560. So you would look at that. We're just dropping to this area. And once we take out that, there's nothing till that 2380. Mm. So you can see that this is now down six days in a row. This is drop. I, I shorted it right there, right on the high of that day, 2975. And so I've got four dollars, you know, on a twenty-five dollar stock. So it's like twenty percent profit in uh, five days. So twenty-five fifty. Wow, forty-five. This thing is motoring. And you know, so, so, you know. So I showed you that ledge, and now it's just like going off a cliff. There's like no support. Uh, you've got some support between twenty-three eighty and here, and then nothing, nothing, open air. <laughs> so, uh, I mean, you know, I could just, uh, you know, so this is where it gets really hairy, where you know it's going to happen, but you have such a big position that it's it's hard to be objective when, A, you're making so much, and B, you know, you think, well, you could forfeit so much if it kind of rallies against you. So that's where, you know, the, you know, trading is in between, you know, the six inches between your ears. It's the demon's. And the market exposes those demons. And the thing is just to get distance. So this is the party, man. 155 and 31, 180, 90 grand, you know, in one thing that I've just held for four days now. Boring, but, you know, I, I like boring. I like just something that I can hold on to. And a 50% haircut here on these Uber calls. Mm. Uh, and then Myrna, you know, kind of getting bent here. But that's that's the thing is that one, you know, and people say, well, what's your win loss ratio? I can lose on six trades and win on one, and it's just the other, the one pays for the whole party. So you can see, yeah, 45 to 1.3 million. 1.3 million dollars short. So pop out a profit for 118,000 there. So you can see how this is going crazy now. You can see how the market just going nuts. I bet like a, a million six on this position. I'm showing right now twenty-three thousand dollar gain.